Uh, today, what's very important is to be able to influence uh, consumer behaviors and get them to, to do new things, right? And the difficulty is that as an industry, we're not always very successful when you see what comes out of uh, the marketing process as a whole. Uh, for example, this is just an example, and I got this slide for a, almost any other category of what we ended up doing in comms, uh, and these are all different brands, right? And the issue with that is that pretty much probably the core issue behind that results and this sea of sameness in some sense uh, is the fact that probably you had the same types of creative brains in the room when the, those campaigns were conceived and in the end you end up with kind of the same results. So it's probably a lack of diversity uh, and originality in the, in the inception of uh, coming up with these campaigns and that also happens into innovation. So our, our belief at ACA is very much that you need to bring a fresh pair of eyes on the business topics, uh, might be for innovation or communications, you, you need to bring crazy people into the room. And if you think about people who've been really disrupting industries lately, people like Richard Branson, for example, uh, Richard Branson is not an airline, an airline expert. He's someone who just had the experience of flying and was not satisfied with the experience he was getting across the Atlantic. And actually, he started from the experience he wanted to get. And from there, he built a very successful uh, airline uh, based on these new ideas he could bring. And actually, you also leverage professionals from the airlines industry to actually come up uh, with uh, Virgin Airlines. So uh, the, the belief is very much that, yeah, let's bring new people into the equation. The way we do that at AK is using crowdsourcing. I'll talk about it. And it's through a creative community that sits on the platform, AK.com where you have almost 400,000 creative people uh, that will be designers, uh, copywriters, some people can do video, uh, product uh, designers, design thinking experts. They are mostly millennials, so there's these traits of forward-looking uh, consumers that actually give you insight into where consumption patterns and uh, behaviors are going. Um, and that will be people who be, could be a creative dentist or could be, uh, that could be a professional uh, uh, designer or art director that's working in an agency and is tired to working on the same brands at, uh, all the time. Very global community, 164 countries. What we do and the reason we come to our platform is really to collaborate uh, with brands uh, like PNG on interesting challenges. Uh, so what we do is that we take a strategically um, uh, formatted question and we turn that into a stimulus, a brief that anyone could understand. So to, to be able to work on that brief, you, you're not supposed to know the brand, we educate you about the brand, you're not supposed to know about the target audience, we'll give you an understanding of a persona you have to solve the challenge uh, to. Uh, and we run that as a competition that will, there will be a, a few thousands of dollars attached to a few winners, typically three winners, will win something out of a competition and we put the brief on our platform. And over the course of 10 days, we'll get around 500 people who go into the brief and read it into details. Obviously, they'll accept the terms and condition by which their intellectual property will be transferred uh, to the client. Um, and depending on the time they have, whether they think they have a good, good idea, whether they have, are actually feel they are able to crack the challenge, we'll get around 100 solutions. Uh, and I'll show you examples, but these are pretty much product designs or experience designs or communication prototypes uh, in some way, which we then gather, curate, um, and in the end, the best ones get transferred to the brand uh, and the IP gets transferred. Um, the reason why these people are, are participating, so imagine you have one of people who actually do something and only three of these people will win uh, uh, prize money. Actually, the, the core motivation is very much that these people are very creative and they don't have the opportunity on a daily basis to express that muscle. Uh, so they come to the platform to find great briefs, to have fun, they have a lot of fun creating, and when they win, it's very much about validation I won a competition, so now I feel I'm competent, and actually the, the, the money is just the cherry on the cake of rewarding the effort you've put into creating that great concept. Um, amazingly, and that very disruptive 
uh, for this group uh, or for us as researchers is very much that gray IDs really come from anywhere. So uh, sometimes we have clients telling us, oh, we only want IDs from China because where it's a project for China. And actually, the best IDs routinely 92% of times will come from a different market. Uh, because if you've done a good job of explaining the consumer issue you, or attention you're trying to solve for and the context of that uh, challenge, but someone, uh, actually, insights can be pretty universal pretty often. And actually, someone in another market who have collided on something that maybe people in China have not and will be a novel solution to crack the challenge. Um, so that's, that's a, uh, our routine is very much to, to see those ideas flowing. What we, we found uh, is the, uh, being the perfect, I will say, uh, integration of that uh, crowdsourcing approach is very much that first you need to have a very strong brief. Uh, rooted in deep consumer insights and with a real tension into a brief. Then you uh, do that uh, process of ideation for the crowd. Uh, and then what's very important is that you, you shouldn't expect um, the, the perfect solution coming from by magic from the crowd. Actually, these are nuggets. These are pointers. These are uh, starters of solutions that actually, if you bring those solutions into a creative workshop with your teams, with R&D, uh, CMK, uh, marketing people, uh, then you can elevate those ideas to concepts that will be much stronger. And when you evaluate those uh, concepts, uh, you find out that they work much better. And actually, the average performance increase is 20 to 40% better than the regular ideas that you'll get from a workshop. Uh, so to give you an example of how it plays in motion into innovation, uh, this is a brief I received from uh, PNG uh, five years ago about, and the question was very much, look, we have all these fantastic uh, chips and the features we can put in the connected toothbrush of the future. The, the only issue is that how can we make it relevant to people? Uh, how do we create those solutions that actually will make people's life better? So we, we submitted that unbranded challenge. No one could tell it was PNG by then. Uh, so confidentiality was protected. We got 67 IDs. So these are example of IDs. Like the, the top right one comes from China, and it's um, it's Guitar Hero for a toothbrush. If you play your teeth like this, the music goes crazy. If you stay like it, it doesn't play. It's gamification, right? And it's a nugget that then has been uh, integrated in the apps. Uh, you have another um, move of gamification. Uh, here you have the speaking toothbrush that gives you, that coaches you on how to improve your toothbrushing. And when uh, PNG was able to have um, uh, the sensors of the 3D sensors of where, which teeth actually you've been brushing or not, then they could implement that feature. And so all of that has been influencing the, the roadmap for uh, 2014 to 2017 of innovation uh, populated with uh, those ideas and those trends that emerge uh, starting with this connected toothbrush. Uh, so in a nutshell, the, the, what that this process and this community brings is very much the freshness of a new pair of eyes, at, I would say in a programmatic way, that's something we can replicate across the world and across brands. Um, it's very fast, and in the end, what really brands get is the efficacy, the, the, the effectiveness of the concepts are much better, so down the road you get much better outcomes.